Friends, as we all know that JE Main 2014 application process has already started from 15th of November 2013. So in today's video, we are going to talk about JE Main 2014 application process. The last date for application is 26th December 2013. Here are the exam dates for offline exam. For paper 1 and paper 2, the exam will be held on 6th of April 2014. Whereas, paper 1 online exam for BE BTEC only, the exams will be held on 9th, 11th, 12th and 19th of April 2014. The exam will be held in two different shifts. Before you start filling the application form, please read the instructions, procedure and information bulletin carefully. Candidates can apply for JE Main 2014 online only through the official website of JE Main. The link is given on the screen. To apply online, follow these three simple steps. Step 1. Fill the online application form, choose your password and note down system generated application number. The candidates should supply all the details while filling the online application form and also required to choose password and security question and enter his or her answer. After successful submission of the data, application number will be generated and it will be used to complete the remaining steps of the application form and also required for all future correspondence. Step 2. Upload scanned images of photograph, signature and thumb impression. Step 3. Pay examination fee by debit or credit card or each elan of syndicate Canara or ICICI bank. Now let's take a look on the online application form filling process. Now I am going to tell you how to fill the online application form. So before filling the application form, please do read the instructions carefully. Now we can see there are different fields. First is exam related details. You have to mention what are you applying for, JE main paper 1 or paper 2 or paper 1 and 2 both. Then your mode of examination whether it is online or offline and your medium Hindi or English. After filling this you have to mention your name, your mother's name, your father's name, your eligibility, the category you have to mention whether it is SC, General, ST or OBC. You have to select yes or no and you have to select yes or no in the field of person with disability and then you have to mention the date of birth where you have to click on uh, then you have to mention the date of birth the day month and the year and then the gender in case of a girl candidate are you only child of your parents you have to select accordingly. Then the nationality, your place of residence and if you have your Aadhaar number do mention that also. Then after filling uh, personal details and exam related details you have to fill the form of academic details that is your 10th passing year, your 12th qualifying examination, the code, the place of class 12th or qualifying exam schooling, your year type of institutions of class 12th or qualifying exam, the percentage, roll number, appearing for improvement, where if it is, the mode of preparation, the name of the school or college from where you have passed or the address of the school. After filling all these details, you have to mention your mailing address details, where you have to mention your complete address, including the locality, city, district, then state, pin code, email address, your mobile number. And if you have any land phone number, do mention with this STD code. And then your guardian details, your father's qualification, his occupation, his annual income, as well as your mother's too. After that, you have to choose your password. And after selecting or after mentioning the password, you have to confirm it with a security question and answer. And at the end, you have to mention the security pin number which is there on the screen. Once you do that, then you can just have a look 
and then click on next after clicking on next your page will be redirected to uploaded images where you have to upload the Im images of your scanned signatures and your photographs once the images are uploaded then the fee payment page will be redirected and then you have to and then you have to submit your fee either online or through bank chalan so friends this was the online application form filling procedure for more details on payment by debit or credit card or by bank e chalan please click on the link given on the screen here are some important points which a candidate should remember take a look all correspondence related to je main 2014 should be addressed to the executive director je main cbsc fie 482 patpaganj industrial area delhi 110092 the application number printed on the computer generated acknowledgement page must be mentioned in all such correspondences it is therefore essential to note down the application number printed on the acknowledgement page the candidate will be able to modify the particulars before the payment of fees once the payment of fee has been made or e chalan downloaded candidate particulars cannot be edited for more information on je main 2014 exam please click on the link given on the screen thank you